What's up guys? Um today What's up guys today we're looking at the breaking point of uh, iPhone 2021 and the breaking point story mode. This is the first episode, second episode is gonna come later on and I uh, hope you enjoy it. I've chosen the Williams team and uh, let me and this is the prologue, we're gonna start by the F2 race. Okay. Oh wait, which F2 team is it? Oh wow. Uh, I'm not sure which F2 team this is. But yeah. An incredible race! Look at it! Every driver is so, so aggressive! Check it out! They're all really feeling the pressure right now. None more so than young Ian Jackson, you call it. That's right! Rumors from the band that can put them over. Oh yeah! Kamara, we need to finish first in the F2 to win this actually stands true. Okay. And we're in P4. I mean, that's that's a dive bomb there like that. Uh going to wipe that corner, another good corner. Oh my god, it's Lord it's Lord it's Lord Mahavir. How is he still in F2 though? Wait, does this mean this is I think this is the 2019 S2 season or something because yeah, yeah, that makes sense because then uh, that's why that's why uh, Ragunathan is still there. DRS and Ragunathan, let's try and catch up to the CP. Wow, let's see if he's trying to catch up to the CP. Wow. TP still left her, that's so weird to see. The TP is just right ahead of us. He's trying to catch up to him. Good corner, good corner. And... I mean, it's an okay breaking. Could have been better. No, I had a good corner there, too wide. Come on. hit the apex there, like if he's right ahead of us, I think. Did we get the eyes? Oh wow, okay. I think he didn't have speed there, he had a, a horrible corner there. No speed at all. He didn't even overtake him. Nice move. Good job. Just a good job. Is that Gyoto? Yeah, Gyoto is just right ahead of us. Purple set. Purple set to... Maybe you can just overtake him. Gyoto just right in this DRS straight. Yeah, we're getting DRS. Thing is, there, there's no, there's no rich fuel mixture even in the F2, even in the 2019 season in this game. That means there's no, you can't, you can't have an upgraded speed or something. But and there's no ERS in F2. So, yeah. But yeah, we to out win the, uh, win the lead of the Grand Prix. Let's see if we can get if we can get uh, 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 if we can get Gyoto out of the RDRs oh uh, out of our DRS uh, like uh, out of the DRS that was not a good uh, couple of corners it's almost a commentating it's not focused there there okay good corner good speed not a good breaking very bad breaking while then hit the apex 
try and speed in that corner as well, then hit the apex again, hit the wall. Okay, that's great work. Taking you up after the, the race. And yeah, we, we got two seconds and two seconds and your top. Another good corner there, another good corner, another good straight as well. Let's see how this corner goes. Yeah, okay, nice, nice. Oh, hit the, hit the small bar. Another good corner. Don't no speed in the corner in that, in that parallel. In that parallel. a bad lag. Hug again. Oh my god, this one is confused. Corner, I just hit the apex, see if you can carry speed, but then the, the two seconds on your to have been lost back to 1.5, 1.6 now. Oh, yeah, and I actually turned the bridge back to 60. I was getting too much oversteer on 50. Sorry, too much understeer. That's it. I guess this makes us. This Fantastic takes us. Work, to the Great effort. drive, mate. Congratulations. Yeah. Oh yes! my. Did you, did you guys see that? That uh, helmet design, actually. Did you, did you, did you guys see that? That uh, helmet he design, is. actually. The man of the moment. Aiden Jackson. An amazing race and a fantastic win for this incredible driver. Indeed. After this, I guarantee that Jackson will be the hot topic in more than a few years. The future's the definitely bright for this young driver. Oh wait, that's that's the what's it called? I forgot his name. Uh he's like a liaison or something. But he's not the team boss. Achievement unlocked the beginning. Uh, Prologue completed for breaking point. Aiden. Oh yeah. Now you've no made no the news. leap to Formula One. No surprise to anyone who's been watching your career. How does it feel to be on the verge of getting behind Will the Buxton. wheel for your first race? To be honest with you, Will. It hasn't really quite sunk in yet. The team has given me a fantastic opportunity. It's a once in a lifetime, a dream come true. So, to answer your question, I feel like a little kid. I look around and I'm surrounded by my heroes, you know? I've even had to pinch myself a couple of times. So, yeah, it, it can be a bit overwhelming, but out on the track, speed, the noise, even the smell. It's all the same. I just hope my driving is too. And what about Casper Ackerman? Are you intimidated at all having such a seasoned and experienced driver as your first teammate in Formula One? How's that relationship coming along? I've always looked up to Casper as someone to aspire to. Growing up well, as a kid, it, his pictures were all over my bedroom walls, you know? Oh, so the like, Casper Ackerman is Aiden Jackson's, but, as it turns out, like, idol or something. Casper, which is good enough for me. Oh. I get to learn from the best. Besides, every legend has to start somewhere, right? Oh, Aiden, oh, a legend. just wondering if we can get your reaction to the obvious comparisons that are being made between you and another F1 driver. 
Much like you, he made the transition from F2 to F1 last season. What do you say to the press here and to your fans who are calling you the new Devon Butler? <laughs> Devon Butler. Devin Butler. I'm alright with that. Does that mean we can lose the old one? <laughs> you come over well. They like you. I don't know what you were worried about. Thanks. You know, everything's going to be fine so out there. So much. I just know so it. high. Just Can you hear it in the, in, the, in the audio as well? Easy. Oh yeah, his name is Brian Doyle. Thanks, he has the liaison between the uh, team know. and the driver. And even the team. And also cast back and... Come on, Aiden. You've got this. By the way, it's a nice time to say, check out my Instagram and my Twitch. Probably things will come up there and yeah. Even for, and also subscribe to the channel, like the video, share and keep uh, post notifications on so that you can you can so that you don't miss out on the on other videos. Brian's for calling us. Hello. Of course I'm in my room. Hey, you just met me. Are you in your room? Oh, hey Brian. Yeah, I'm in my room. Good. Of course I'm in my well, room. You just met me. I hope you like it. Should be everything you need in there. News feeds, social media. Are you hooked up to the lot? Damn it, just says, do yeah. me a favour, eh? Go on. Make sure you check your emails. I think there's a message in there for you. Oh, Jimmy right. Broadbent. Thanks, Brian. Take a breather. Do what you need to do, and I'll see you before the race. Nice one. Arva, wow, is it too it's too early to call for Mercedes? Uh email Sam Roberts, Jeff Nelson, and Casper. Hello? Hello love. Mom's calling this one. How's it going? Alright, Ma. Yes, yeah, going alright. Just getting ready. Uh, I Casper saw just written as good luck. And? You need a ah, haircut. Okay, let's go to the first all race. Right. Well, thanks, I guess. But aside from that, you were great. I'm so proud of you, Aiden. I know, Ma. Thanks. I wish I could be out there with you. This is everything you've worked towards. Yeah, I know, but you'll be at the next one. Just do what you do, and everything will be great. Thanks, Ma. And remember, mirror Ma signal maneuver. I didn't see always stick to the speed limit. Great advice. I'm all over it. I know you are, love. I'll speak to you later. <laughs> well. Good luck. Bye. Okay, let's check the rewards quickly. Oh, just a new helmet design. I'll probably take that for my F19 career mode. Haha! <laughs> just to, just to get, give you guys a sneak peek of what's coming. I'll be doing also a F19 career mode uh, videos. Yeah, so post, not uh, turn, post notifications for that, and uh, you'll probably see it. But yeah, let's go to the Austrian Grand Prix. When the world watching and expeditions high volumes of relocating Jackson appears to be holding his own in his maiden race in Melbourne. The possibility of a points finish, he keeps focus on the race in front of him. Okay, so the race already started with mid race and uh, I don't know what we're supposed to do. Probably supposed to get in the points or something. This is chapter one and let's go. A solid start, Aiden. Let's try and push it further. Copy that. Uh, where's Casper? And did you see that? He's up ahead. Yeah. Let's try and bring you two closer together. And and we're overtaking. Well, so it is in P14. Ahead of us is Daniel Ricciardo. And uh, Casper is in P10. So he's the point. We need to beat him. Get into the points, I guess. Uh, 
grab it over there. Let's just hope. Okay, that's a good. Good corner, good corner. Game freeze there, game freeze again. Wow. Okay, corner. Not a good corner. Another second corner. Not a good second corner. Up into overtake and uh, overtake. We're closing up to Ricciardo. I don't know who's ahead of Ricciardo and how is it possible that Ricciardo is in P13? I don't remember the trend of being that bad. Stream freeze again. And to overtake. We're in the we're in the one sec we're in the one second of Ricciardo but the still no DRS. Us is I think we're getting to DRS now. No, no DRS yet. So even though it's 0 0.8 seconds. Ricciardo. Okay, we've caught up to someone. I think that's Magnuson because I can see the Haas. And I don't believe Roger, I don't believe Roger is there. Is Magnuson P12 or is he P20? And like he's just a P12 or is he P20? And like he's just a Casper's in P10 at the moment. Oh, he's P12. Wow. Okay. See, that's the thing. How is a Will? That's the thing. How is a Williams in P10? And how a Haas is fighting for points? When there's, a, I don't think there are any. When I think, I don't think there are any um, DNFs or nice something. Move. Good and job. oh, we pushed, we pushed. Okay, I can manage to take the overtake because I, I don't think there are any DNFs. And the B, and the racing point is down in P and P16. It's kind of unrealistic, but okay. Ricciardo will take it, me and Ricciardo have taken overtaken in uh, Magnuson. Let's see if it, we can overtake Ricciardo here. No, we don't look that low. He locks up the stars. Second corner, DRS again. Let's see if we can get here. Maybe do some leg breaking. Give Ricciardo a taste of his own medicine. Some screen freeze again. But no leg breaking. Okay, we're in this one second, but he's increasing the gap. I don't know how we will overtake him. Here we find out. We pause. Okay. Yaris and Ricciardo. Casper's in P10 at the moment. Enough. Maybe the next. Maybe the next. Maybe, maybe. Oh no. Okay, here we can. That's a beautiful overtake. Beautiful. That's some late breaking masterclass right there. Oh, it's Devin Butler. Oh my god, that's a bad Okay, idea. you're catching the car ahead, yeah, but the remember, we need to get us. to the end of the race on these tires. Devin Butt light up us. Jeff, You're look at the percentages. 16, now, 12, job. 13, and 12. We've caught up to Devin Butler. We are on his tail. Not a good exit from there. I couldn't take the corner as well because but is doing better things. Casper is a couple of places up on you. We can see Casper from here. He's only two seconds above us. We can probably catch him up because the goal is before lap 11. We're just behind Butler. Maybe we can overtake him on the on this VR straight. I 
Yankees get close to him. Oh, we push them. We we'll push the car. We we'll push them in my gear. Do we have damage? I don't think this damage enabled. Or maybe it's just not the highest. Because that would have been a quadrant damage if we just take my Okay. And but now again, I'm sure get him with the RS trade on the start finish trade. And okay. We're only 1.7 seconds behind. Casper is directly uh, behind Casper. We've got the RS 1.4. 1.4, 1. 1.3, 1.4, 1. 1.3, 1. 1. 1.3, oh, cut in, cut in. There certainly is Crofty, and these two have been fighting each other incredibly hard so far. Wow, this episode's going to be long, because I've done the two, for F2 race and the first F1 race. Hey, Casper's not your priority, we need you to defend. Okay, so Aiden is gonna attack on Casper and David Butler is coming. And he says, yeah. Oh no, that's not gonna go well. That's not gonna go well. Oh my god, Casper goes off. Yeah, I think Casper goes off, he's got his front wing. And there we have it. I'm sure there's going to be fireworks in the Williams garage tonight. There will be Crofty for sure. Look, it was a late move from Devon Butler, but you never want to see two teammates make contact. And Ackerman will surely be seething at that one. Absolutely. And I'll tell you who else isn't going to be happy too. Aiden Jackson. Not how his F1 race debut should have gone. The damage appears to be minor. How's it yeah. feeling, Aiden? <laughs> yeah, cars okay. Aiden, Understood. Uh, Aiden, See how well you can cars. do out there. Yeah, it's cars. Copy. Okay, so the objective is finish the race. Maybe let's try and get Devin Butler and get back into the points. Yeah. The gap to the car ahead is 2.3 seconds. The gap was 2.2 seconds. It's increasing. Maybe he's getting VRS of the Norris or something. Still 2.3 seconds, 2.4 seconds. A lot of time lost there. We have five laps of fuel remaining. Let's get to him. Oh, not a good corner. I didn't hit the apex. Good corner here, but good acceleration. Our tire was also getting kind of. I, I think Jeff was Jeff was right. Tire was tire was you know, impact a lot in our speed here. That's a very bad, very bad corner, very bad exit. Yeah, put the car to overtake mode. We're leading our teammate by 10.2 seconds. This gap is increasing to Casper, but it's not the the gap is also decreased uh, to Butler is also decreasing. Now we're under his two seconds. That's not a good. That's not a good corner there. Too wide. Two point four seconds. But Casper is eleven seconds behind. Two point four seconds to Butler. Let's see if he can catch back. Catch him back here. I think he's squabbling with. <laughs> I think he's squabbling with Lando. No other good exit. Got a little bit onto the grass. The 
There's four laps of fuel remaining. Okay, so we have three laps to catch up to Butler. Let's see if we can do this. We just need to be constant. We're starting to catch the car in front, we but we need to, to look after constant. the tires. We won't be making another pit stop. Good, good corner right there. 1.7 seconds. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Good corner as well right there. Don't mess this up. Oh my, oh. Okay, yeah, now tires have gone yellow. We've gone fully yellow. The 30% of the front, front left and 24% of the front right. 35 on the rear left and 23 on the rear Our gap right. to the car in front is 2.2 2 seconds. Not good, not good exits there. Yeah, not a good exit. Okay, it's gone up to 3 seconds now. Whoa, what? Yeah, he's... He's squabbling with... With Lando. They've caught up to... I think it's... Gasly or Kvyat? I am not know, sure. Speed right there. This one as well. Good exit. Oh no, I'm not a good turn right there. We have not two good. laps of fuel remaining. Okay, I'll speed here as well. That's two. It's basically two okay, laps. Okay, gap here. ahead is three two point one seconds. And we're going over the grass. I don't think we can do this because we're constantly losing time to to Butler. But we've we've increased our gap over to over Vettel and Ricciardo, but we can't seem to be uh, we can't seem to be decreasing our gap to Butler, which just means. We have speed. This is your we final lap, pace. final lap of the race. Enough. Yeah, now we got 24 seconds. It's probably gonna be a P11 for... For Aiden Jackson. Well, th this is giving me George Russell vibes. He has the pace, but he can to the points. Comment down below if you're getting the same... The same vibes. Um, in Jackson, especially since he's using the Williams. It's a much more re realistic George Russell, George Russell finish here. The gap to the car behind is 8.1 seconds. If this happened, because, because, like, having a force, because uh, like the four, four second gap counts. 4.7, second gap can't be, uh, can't be done. It can't be done in one lap with increasing tire wear. Not a good couple of exits there from the from the corners. Didn't hit the apex on the second one. Can't. Yeah, it's the end of the race. I think and you have a debrief in this game. That's the end of the race. We'll see you in Park Fermi. I don't know. Let me see. But yeah, that's all. Nothing. Nothing else to add. That's the end of the race. Victory. No points. Missing out just on, just on P11. Missing out just on P11.
A real team victory Could today. Everybody played their part. Congratulations then to Mercedes. You're race winners Let's today. To the podium, the I think that was Benjamin Daly. That was a that was a mild Marduk there, Tim Marduk. Because he, I think Tiamat Marduk, Jimmy Broadbent, and and Arava's faces are all in the game as like, as like uh, different people. I'm not sure. And it's been like that since a lot of time. Sometimes the engineers, sometimes they're just the like team, part of the team. Like they, they, they want to pull. He was. Kevin Marduk was on the podium. Listen, I don't know what happened out there. It wasn't my fault. Well, whose fault was it then? Who was the idiot behind the wheel the of your car? The hmm? You're pathetic. You won't even admit when you made a mistake. I'm... How did they ever sign you? Oh. Butler. Ahem, um, Devon. I didn't see that. I what, like, out on the track today? You nearly took me out, mate. Look, I don't know what happened. You cut in, I swerved. Next thing I knew, Casper was out. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mate, I was nothing to do with it. Whatever that was, that was all on you. Don't be trying to pass the blame, because you haven't settled in yet. Sorry, Aiden. Just bear with us one sec. No problem. Good. Seems to me like seems to me like Devin Butler has continued that attitude from uh, it, from F1 2019, where he was like, you know, selfish, seems to say, because he was all about himself. Yeah, you see, he's still out of my mind. Seriously. What on earth Williams were thinking? <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Thanks, Devin. I mean, it was and was because of okay. because of Devin and Aiden Jackson. Both of them had a role to play in that in that accident. Because if Devin Butler well, hadn't cut in, then there would be space, and he knew that it was going to be three wide because he was from behind and knew what was going to happen. And also, Eden should have just blocked Brian, off, uh, uh, blocked off, uh, okay? yeah, fine. the butler, Listen, but they have a phone call from Brian. It all under control and then... Look, let's not go through all that now. We'll talk about it in the debrief. Right, yeah. I was actually talking about your little running with Casper and Butler over in the paddock. Oh, wow. News travels fast. The paddock talks, Aiden. Besides, I've got ears like the hawk. Listen, Butler's a clown. The man's ego is bigger than a... No, I've got nothing. Don't give it a second thought. Thanks, Brian. The Casper? <laughs> yes, yeah, so he can get a little hot-headed, especially after a race. But you have got to work with him. That manoeuvre today... Wasn't my fault, Brian. It probably cost us up. points. Go I'll level with you. A lot of people on the team are disappointed, Aiden. And I'll be saying as much to Casper. Now, learn from it and move on. But you can't let it happen again. I'll see you at the debrief. Yeah, there was a post by Tim and Marduk. And let's check the rewards and I think that's all for today. No, no free pass rewards on Currency of Four, and that's all. I thank you guys. I thank you guys. Uh, this, uh, that's all for today. Breaking points chapter two. We we'll also I will also be uploading that. But yeah, just like, as just subscribe. Check, uh, click on the notifications 